is 4.18 in the morning and today's trip is going to be in the Atlantic. I'm going to go fishing from the Atlantic uh, close to between 20 to 30 miles out and the wind is supposed to be about 15 miles per hour in the morning which is a little high but later on in the midday I'm supposed to get almost 11 miles per hour winds. Uh, the seas are three feet which last time I came to the Atlantic and it was full moon and that was a terrible fishing day. I never had a fishing day that bad out here. Let's see how it goes. It's 5.30 in the morning and I'm heading out really early because I'm Really early so I can get to the fishing ground. I got about another 20 some more miles. Pretty sure I'm gonna get to the fishing ground while it's still dark or maybe the sun coming up. Alright, shut these lights off. be a beautiful day today. No rain, uh, very little wind, not too much wind. 13 miles per hour wind to 14 at the beginning and then later uh, it goes down to 11. And the weather conditions that I read is supposed to be three foot seas. Let's see if that's also uh, true. Uh, three foot seas at six seconds apart. So hopefully today I get something for lunch that I can eat. The ocean feels very calm. I'm doing about 25, 26 miles per hour and you don't feel it. Yep, the sun is about to come up. It is 6 morning in the morning. in the morning but the chart plotter just changed time zones to 544 in the morning it looks like once you leave United States uh, you get another time zone probably the Bahamas time zone because um, yeah one hour went back it's like I'm going back in time so I gained one more hour of fishing that is incredible Awesome. I slept last night about two hours. Again, uh, once before you go fishing and you wake up early, I woke up at three in the morning. So I think the anticipation of going fishing and where you're gonna go and how deep you're gonna go, that anticipation doesn't let you sleep. Go fishing. All right, you caught us up. Look at that beautiful sun. That's just gorgeous right there. Having that sun in the morning come up like that, alone by yourself out here in the middle of nowhere. And look at my chart plotter. Look at that, look at all those fishes right there. Minkota's working hard.
but I'm in a great spot, all right? I'm gonna get everything ready. Enjoy this beautiful sunrise. That is just incredible. I don't get tired of saying it. Awesome. Here we go. Let's see what happens. I'm in a perfect spot here. There's plenty of fish in the sharp water. Let's see if we can get a fish. Look at that giant turtle right there. Look at that. She's huge. She's not pulling hard at all. I think it's a snowy grouper. It has a little white specks. Here for a long 
There it is, now charging the Minkota battery. Another little grunt. All right, it's time for lunch. All right, so I'm gonna eat this uh, fillet and uh, batter. All right, now I'm gonna wash it in salt water. Look at those beautiful fillets. All right, what I'm gonna do is, I'm going to batter this fish. At least I got something for lunch this time. And I'm gonna put it right here on the batter. Flip it a couple of times. Look at that, how beautiful that meat is. Woo! Talk about being rough today. This batter already has uh, seasoning on it, and the fish was washed on the salt water, so that way it gets that flavor of the ocean. So now what I'm doing, I'm just waiting for the oil to get uh, hot. Look at this, two nice fillets of lane snapper. Look at that, beautiful. Now what I brought for this was, I got some potato bread. This goes well with potato bread. All right, now I'll put both of the uh, fillets here. And I did not forget, I brought my Luciana tartar sauce. Just gonna spread it around the uh, fillet, just like this. Spread it around. All right, I'm gonna try fillet one. Great, with the tartar sauce. Awesome. I think snapper is amazing. And the tartar sauce gave it a nice tangy flavor. I'm gonna turn the air conditioner on because it's pretty hot. Now that I finished lunch, I'm gonna take about 20 minute nap. Uh, the anchor alarm is on. So I'm just gonna take about 20, 25 minute nap. Wake up and uh, keep going fishing. Alright, I'm gonna get back on fishing. 
rest it a little bit. It's very wavy. It's moving like a roller coaster. Look at that. It's incredible. All right, I'm gonna get back on fish. All right, got something here. Probably some other grunt. Another little grunt. Nobody in it. Uh, and we'll be looking for more items. If we... I hope they're okay. Um, Roger, Captain. We appreciate it. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go trolling back home. I got a cedar plug that this Captain Scott gave to me when I was in the Florida Keys. Thank you, Scott. I'm gonna try that uh, cedar plug. Today, it is kind of rough. Let's see how it works. It is rough. to get back home with this crazy waves. Probably about an hour and nothing. Maybe it's because it's rough. Really wavy. This was the catch of the day. Not bad. This one is mine, the lane snapper. We just powdered them lightly so it doesn't stick to the pan. Now we're gonna get this fried and eat away. Yum yum. You want fish too? Hmm?
took out of the Reese camera? You can't do yeah. that. Now yeah. it's a party. Now it's a party. She don't care. She just wants to chase squirrels. Coming home after a beach day. You can see all the salt on the boat. It's incredible. There's salt everywhere. Look at this. Look at that. Look at that salt. There's salt everywhere. The boat is full of salt. So right now what I'm doing is I'm putting some water on it. Let it thaw out a little bit. And then washing it. And hopefully I can get all that salt out. And try some of the small fish I caught. It's looking good. Awesome. I'm hungry. Alright. So soon I'll be done. I'm going to keep on cleaning the boat so we can get this done. Roxy's having fun out here. Taking advantage that we're out here. Every time we're outside, she loves it. Good girl. Mm -hmm. Not good for anybody getting water in the oil. Ooh, this is looking good. A little hard to flip. Is that the limit? Huh? Is that the limit, a hundred? A lot of work after fishing. Sure is. A lot of clean up. This is the catch of the day. We have some fried rice my mom made. She brought it over so good. And she made some salad too. So all we were missing was the fish. All right, we're gonna eat now. And I'm gonna get some rest. I'm really tired. Thank you for watching and navigate safe. Okay, let's dig in.